Hello everyone, welcome back to another LEGO custom build. Today I'm going to be showing you this custom LEGO barbershop that took me about one day to build. So let's get started and view the details. So starting with the front of the barbershop, we just simply have this nice little walkway where your minifigures can walk and uh, check out the other stores on the street. There's a nice little bench here where your minifigs can sit. There's also a trash can where people can... Uh, stick their chewing gum, dispose them, and over here there's a nice little lamp post. And as you notice on both sides of the doors, there are some nice little barbershop logos. So it kind of just stands out. So if, if I was an actual minifigure walking on the street, I would notice um, that that's a barbershop. And uh, I uh, didn't have so many of these blue um, three by slope elements. So I had to use these printed ones, but it kind of does give the shop a little touch. And uh, the shop roof does pop off, and you can see the inside of it. So let's check that out right now. So moving on into the shop, we basically just have this nice little red door with a mat. And uh, the floor is checkered, so I kind of like how it turned out. And uh, this is kind of based on like the 1900s, like the 1960s, 70s. So, um, just a simple little family business, I guess you can say. Um, it can fit, uh, well, I guess you can say one person can get his hair cut at a time. So, um, it's not like one of those great clips places where you can get multiple people getting their hair cut because the business is running, uh, fluently. But, um, this is just one of those simple, cute little businesses. Just slap down like ten bucks, get your hair cut, you know. So, um... On the window to the right there are some mannequins and a space shuttle poster on the back wall. Now I kind of just wanted to um, put posters in this building. There are two of them. There's another one over there. I just put them in just to add some details into the shop. And uh, to the left of the mat there is a nice little cash register. Um, somebody slapped down $100. If you can't see that, that, that does say $100. Um, I do kind of wish that the LEGO company created bills that were like ten dollars, five dollars, twenty dollars, kind of like, um, contrib like kind of just like how the American, the real American dollars go, um, instead of just having a hundred dollar bills because in those Lego stop motion movies you might see somebody pay for ice cream and they'll slap down on a hundred dollar bill and just, um, just kind of weird. I find that to be pretty weird. I mean, why would you pay a hundred dollars for an ice cream? But um, just something that I. Don't really, don't really admire about the Lego uh, money currency. I guess everything is $100, <laughs> I guess you can say. But there's a nice little American flag and a uh, computer. I might have already said that, sorry. So that was the details on the inside. I'm planning on making a couple more of these to create a nice little street where people can walk and go shopping or uh, get their hair cut, you know, just simple stuff. I'm planning on maybe putting a pet shop or something or a cafe. I think there's just um, would look really nice if a bunch of these were combined together. So stay tuned for that and um, also be doing future LEGO custom builds and uh, tutorials. So um, please stay tuned and thank you for watching.